Hello. It's the 15th of February. We got two weeks left of season. Uh, I'm sorry about the wind. It's just brisk out here. Uh, gosh, I hope you guys are having a great day. Um, I just put in a new set. It is freaking cold. Uh, my fingers are froze, so I'm not going to be long here. That's for darn sure. Uh, I just want to show you this quick set. I don't even know if it's in the camera because I can't see the camera because of the sun. Whew. It's uh, it's not single digits. It's 11 degrees, hence the not having my face covered up. But I kind of think maybe I should have because I am cold. All right, hold on a second. All right, there we go. We got a little dirt hole set. Um, actually, it worked out really well because up underneath that snow, there's a nice pocket in the grass, and I was able to put that bait way back up in there and uh, smear a little bit around, put some urine on it, and. Uh, we're not supposed to get any snow for the next couple of days, I don't think, from what I understand. It's supposed to be cold, but uh, no snow. So hopefully, we got some soul taker in there. Hopefully, that'll do some calling for me. And, uh, hey, we'll find out what happens. I'm going to go check the rest of the line. It's freezing cold. It's it's the wind is what it is. So, anyway, I'm going to roll on. Um, hope you guys are having a great day. It's Saturday. Uh, I'm thinking about uh, Nicole hikes a lot. She's down in the Smoky Mountains right now. Just a shout out to her. Can't wait to see the video of what you got, uh, your trip down there and what you guys did. So, all right, I'm moving on. Have a good one. All I can say is, man, patience is a virtue. So, you can see that this was obviously a coyote. This is where that pipe dream was. You can actually still see I left the Q-tips there. Um, I had a pipe dream here. <laughs> yeah, that's where I caught that other one right there. So, yeah, he dug it up. So, last night they were out in a boat. He didn't make it over to that other set. But, more man, if I'd, have, if I'd have put out this set last night, I probably would have had one this morning. Uh, oh, well. We'll see what happens. It looks like he came down the line here. Um, I do have a couple more traps down that way. So, I'm going to go check it out. But my hands are frozen, and uh, I'm going to put my choppers back on and whew, get her going. I worked 18 hours yesterday, so I had a, I should have been out here earlier, but I slept in a little. All right, I'm going to get out in the sun a little bit. Thanks for being here, guys. Isn't that awesome? It's just great to be out here. All right, learning something new every day. Thanks. So here I am walking along, and I see all these places where it's been dug up I think holy cow these coyotes were chasing mice like crazy and I mean they're all the way down over there too you know what that's not coyotes at all there's even a nice spot of urine there these are deer doing this I do not know I mean I'm sure they're after greens because it's so cold you can see the spots way over there even um, this is uh, it's definitely um, an interesting thing and I've seen them do this before in other spots but this is probably the most I've ever seen in one spot so anyway thought it might be interesting to see that for you guys they definitely will dig down in that snow and, and look for those green shoots uh, this time of year especially you get a few warmer sunny days and those green shoots some of those green shoots will start growing actually even this cold out um, it's just a phenomena that happens in these fields so okay I'm going to go my fingers are once again frozen. I know you're tired of hearing me say that. So, man, look at even all the way over on that hillside. I don't know if you can see in that sunny patch. All just dug right up. And you can see the deer tracks heading right from here over to there. So, interesting. Okay, I'm gone.